Hey guys, okay, so I'm going to finally be doing um, my long-awaited Halloween haul. I want to show you a few little bits that I've got as like home decor for my room all year round and just other pieces for Halloween that I picked up. So basically I'm going to start with what I got from a shop called Budgeons. Um, I got this kind of spider web kind of bowl with these little legs. And this was great at the party for, um, obviously, to put sweets in or just any other bits and bobs. Um, halfway through the night, I did have the balloons and all the kind of um, um, decorations and stuff that um, we were going to put up throughout the day. That was £1.50 for that. Um, the next thing, which we used at the party, and I managed to clean them up for this video um, to show you, and you've got four cups and they are for £1.50 and they came in green, purple and orange. The reason why we got orange and black is because it's like the like, you know, traditional colours of Halloween. Okay, so my next little um, two pieces, um, which if you follow me on Instagram you would have seen, is um, my Primark chokers. So first, I'll do a little close up, but first I've got my like spider web choker. Um, and it's got like a black velvet um, choker piece and then in the middle we've got cute little metal spider webs um, and that was three quid I think or two quid I can't remember because I forgot to keep it in the case but this one I managed to keep in the case and that was this is three quid for all three so the top one is um, kind of like a fake leather choker with a cute little pumpkin in it um, the second one is kind of like a suede kind of fabric, like shaped, like little spider webs. And the last one is um, like um, just a black metal like chain with like five little bats in the middle. So that's really cute. cute. So and they were three quid. There was a little local shop of mine, and I haven't got all of them here because we did use them at the Halloween party on Halloween. Um, so some of them are it back in my like Halloween decoration thing but basically like one pack was uh, felt, they're made out of felt and like white and black felt and I got a little spider on its spider web and you get two in a pack for 95p and then here's another one that I got and it's a little bat and it's black and white felt and that was also 95p and you got two in a pack and then the next one was this big pumpkin and um, obviously he's black and orange, yeah, black and orange felt, and he was 125 just for him. Okay, so something a little bit different because you don't always see like little felt decorations like that. Um, yeah, okay, two other things you can see um, at the moment. This one I got from like a Poundland, I think it was called, it wasn't called Poundland, but it was like it, everything was pretty much a pound, I can't remember what it's called though. It was one of those types of stores and they're just like little purple bats. And this one I got from just a local kind of um, news agent. Um, and this is also with little black bats and it's just like a plasticky, the other ones. Um, it's like a paper kind of plasticky, you know, the kind of things you get for like one time kind of party things. These ones I'm going to keep up all year round because I really love bats, they're one of my favourite animals and I just love that they're purple, it goes with the um, my bed hanging at the back. Um, but these ones I'll probably take down and keep in my little Halloween decoration box. Obviously the these ones were only a quid and these ones I think were one ninety nine. I don't know, they were quite cheap and I just, you know, they were just in the corner with like a small section of other little Halloween stuff. Um, yeah. Now if I show you um, just a couple of the things um, that I got from Asda was we used this guy at the party too and he's a little bit folded though, um, was this plastic skeleton you can move him about from his joints so you can do him, like get him doing different things and like and that kind of thing so yeah that's quite cool and we had him on the door um, so um, and he was only a quid so yeah 
Okay, the next thing I got from Asda, um, which I haven't even opened yet because I wanted to make sure I had them for this um, video, which I will be displaying on my ceiling, so I'll insert a little clip of that, um, if I can get them out of the packaging. Okay, so I've got three glow-in-the-dark bats, and then I've got three just normal black bats. So, yeah, they're really cute. Um, but yeah, so I'm probably going to put them around my room, or have them like hanging from the ceiling, because I've got like dream catchers and stuff hanging from a ceiling anyway. So I thought it would tie in with that. Um, and especially it will go with my big kind of, it's not a dream catcher, but I have this big spirally thing that I have all year round and it's like it was handmade and they've got little bats and there's a spider in the middle so yeah that was a quid that's why I left it in the packaging because I wasn't going to remember all the prices for everything another bat related thing yeah. it's a skeleton bat I think he's so freaking cute so um, he's also going to go on my ceiling so he can hang down above my bed because he's so cute and wake me up in the morning and um, he was three quid, so yeah. And look, his head turns, which I thought was really cool. The next thing, which they look a bit crumpled, but um, it's because we used them at the party. Obviously these aren't, haven't been used, the other ones have been used, but they've been taken out of the packaging. So they're not as all um, like straight and pristine as they were when I bought them. Um, but yeah, these are from um, Asda 2 and they say Haunted Halloween and I used these to give to some of the trick-or-treaters and we also used them at the party. They were a quid for all of um, like a big pack of them. Next I'm going to show you what I got from Co-op, um, the supermarket, yeah. <laughs> okay, so um, I've got them, you can get them, can you hold it like above the camera maybe, so, no, the, the light, yeah, yeah. So basically you can get these little pumpkin tea lights um, for a quid and you get two in a pack, so that's them in the packaging and then I will show you a little close up. Yeah, basically it looks like you've lit a candle, but obviously it's not real, it's plastic and it's just a light but I like how it just flickers as well as just having a little light so it's like an actual tea light. Next I actually got given this as a gift after Halloween um, but this was originally, I don't know if you can see it because it's see-through, but um, this was originally five quid and um, as you can tell, I don't know if you can see because it's like see-through, but it's a skeleton jug and it's really cool. Next, which we also used in the Halloween party was these little ghosts. Basically, I'll show you a better close-up of them, but they're all a bit tangled at the moment, but basically you can get all of these ghosts that light up um, for a pound. Everything from co-op. Next um, was just in like a little um, local shop. I found this actually um, for two ninety nine, and I just liked it just for all year round as well. And it's just like a little skeleton in a coffin, so it's quite happy. Next, I've got one thing to show you that I got from um, Wilkinson's, and it's a boom! So, yeah. Basically, what I want to do with this is, like, um, wrap, obviously not real, because they'd, like, die on me, <laughs> but, um, like, fake, kind of, like, roses, like, black and red roses, and, like, twine and stuff like that around it, so make it really pretty, but, yeah. So, yeah, and that was a quid from Wilkinson's. It's meant to be, like, a witch's broom, but, yeah. I'm also thinking about maybe spray painting it black, Next, I'm going to show you, which isn't really like Halloween, like, but I thought I could put it into this haul because it's kind of like spooky related, I guess. Um, but basically, it's something I got a book from HMV. There's 101 horror movies you must see before you die. So yeah, so like, I don't know, I'm really into horror and, but I haven't seen a lot of films, like, I don't know, like not just horror, but just in general. I have, like I've missed a lot of films that people have just 
just know so much about and I've never even heard of them. So like I need to do some like, I don't know, nerding out when it comes to films. Um, and I love horror films anyway, like all different types of horrors. So yeah, so I thought this would be perfect to get me started. Hopefully be able to give some new kind of horror films to some of my friends that really like horror films too. I went to Yankee Candle because I know they always do really awesome Halloween decor, like obviously for their candles, but sometimes they do in general anyway. We went there and they had loads of Halloween like little goodies and stuff which was awesome, but it was all 50% off so that was even better and I was like, oh my god, it is my day. So. Um, basically, um, I'll show you these candles first. I don't know if I'm going to show you a close-up of me lighting them. That would be quite cool, but I don't want to, like, burn them just yet, but we'll see. I might get around to doing it, because it is really cool what they do. Basically, you light them. If I show you on here, they're, like, I don't know if you can see, but, um, they're meant to, like, drip, so it looks like your candles are bleeding blood. So, which I thought was really cool. Okay, so this was, um, I bought it for 350 which I thought was really good. It was 50% um, off. Obviously, originally, it would have been £7. So, the fact that I got this for 350 I thought was a bargain. And the next thing I got, I'm just going to unwrap now. Okay, I got two of these. So, I could have, like, one um, on each end of, like, a thing. Um... They did have this also in a larger size as well, but I decided to get, instead of just one large one, I got two little ones. Um, I won't show you both of them, I might in a close-up, but they're exactly the same. So it's just a little ghost. Look at him, look how cute he is. And yeah, so that's basically where you put the candle, the Yankee candle. Then you pop him on top and then yeah, he makes a nice little candle holder. Um, and I got him for 4 50 so I got two of them for 4 50 thing which was the last one in the store so I was like really happy um, now I love pumpkins but I love the colour black more so the fact they had a black pumpkin was pretty awesome look at him yeah. look at his little teeth he's so spooky so yeah I love him and I'm gonna burn stuff in him I think all year round I need to find a place to put him though because he's quite big was one of the, like, the largest thing out of them. Yeah, out of all the little holders and stuff. But basically, um, you, well, I guess you could put like any candle you wanted in it. But they um, they were showing it with like um, the Yankee Candle, like, what are they called? Melts, I think they're called. They're like little sachets and you put them in and put the tea light, tea light at the back of this. And then it burns, obviously makes this a lot hotter. And then it just melts inside the little head of the pumpkin. Um, yeah, so I can't wait to use him. And the fact that it was only eight quid, um, being half price, so it would have been 16, so that was a bargain as well. So, Halloween bargains all round. <laughs> everything I got for Halloween um, that I was able to show you in this video. Um, I hope you enjoyed looking at all my little um, spooky gifts and stuff like that and I hope to see you in the next video. Thank you for watching. Bye!